Okay, what is he doing up here? And where is Vendu? Let me check up. Ah, uh, my favorite characters. And this time I didn't put them here. Let me. Can I use them? My favorite characters. Feels so good to hear her again. <laughs> it is certainly unusual for us to meet in a place like this, but as Lisa said, I'm glad to see you. Hey, what do you mean by a place like this? The tavern is a wonderful place to relax and unwind a little. <sighs> do you have any idea how hard it was for me to drag the acting grandmaster away from her desk? We've only been here for a few minutes, and worry is already written all over her face. <sighs> Lisa. Yeah, this is the acting grandmaster we're talking about. It's only natural that she has a lot on her plate. But you know what they say, now that we're already here. Uh, why don't you let him mix a couple of drinks for you two? It'll make you feel a lot better. Honestly, Jean is the only person I know who needs to be taught how to relax. Hey, cutie, whip me up a love poem. Medium, extra sweet. And how about you, Jean? What are you in the mood for? I'll just have coffee. Medium, please. Master Jean, you drink coffee all the time. Wouldn't you like to try something else? Thanks, but no. I want something to help keep me awake. Thanks. <laughs> Okay, how we do that? We have to do this perfect. It's so sweet. How do you... Oops.
Okay, when they say exa, that means one exa. Okay, coffee. The sweetness is just right. Mmm, very good. Well, we get to see this thing closer. Man, I can't wait for Suma and I hope that these are gonna have, maybe gonna help us get there in the prologue of Suma. Mmm, the coffee is strong and rich with just a nice hint of bitterness to it. Actually, I do understand what you meant, Lisa. Hmm? I've been reflecting on my weaknesses lately. There's still room for me to improve in many areas, such as my productivity and management. I'm concerned my stress may even be starting to somehow affect you as well. What? <laughs> See? Cutie knows. You were working yourself way too hard, so I thought I'd take you out for some drinks. All I wanted was for you to have some fun. But even in the tavern, you're still thinking about work. That's what's most concerning. If you're constantly under stress like this, it's only a matter of time before you burn out. Oh, you also agree with Lisa, Traveler? I agree with anything she say. So... Is learning to relax actually my biggest challenge? Yep! Work hard, play hard, and rest even harder! The two of you may need even more rest than you'd expect! <laughs> Alright, I... I understand. Thank you. All of you. Now I know that this place serves refreshments for both the body and the mind. Is that why you and Kaya like the tavern so much? Yes and no. It really depends on who's making the drinks. Speaking of which, we couldn't have changed Jean's mind without you today. You sure have a way with words, cutie. <laughs> then we'll see you later. I'll consider coming here to relax if I have another opportunity. Care you two. Chad. Bad? Janice, yeah. Young Lee? Yeah, yeah, now I'm curious. How does um, Venti is in here? Although I bet he's gonna be the boss. Ah, traveler. Good to see you. I trust you are well? Wait! Uh, Xiang Li, what are you doing here? If I am to roam about the world, then I certainly mustn't limit my destinations. The free and prosperous land of wind is as splendid a place to visit as any. And it's quite a pleasant surprise to run into you here. One misty garden, please. I take my tea strong, thank you.
I'll see ticket. Sorry to keep you waiting. Hmm. The tea is clear and glows with a pleasing hue. Its richness is complemented by a floral and fruity fragrance. Exquisite. Wow. So Jean Li is even super knowledgeable about tea. He's a walking encyclopedia. Mindfully savoring the tea shows due respect to the person that brewed it for you. Okay, so I need all time of the tea becomes more drama. Like, uh, okay, I get it. He's talking in third person, but she's not a cave man. Tea of good quality is hard to come by, and those capable of brewing tea according to the occasion and emotions even more so. Gets it now. So, could you teach Paimon how to savor tea like you do? It seems you smell it first then drink it, right? That's correct. Every type of tea is unique. The more you drink, the more you will understand the subtle differences. Smelling the aroma will reveal the quality of the tea. Lower grade teas emit a musty and seemingly scorched scent, whereas ones with a delicate yet soothing aroma are usually of a higher quality. If you want to be more particular, according to Liyue ancient tradition, you could acquire a vintage goblet, which is used specifically for examining the aroma. Oh no! All this time, Paimon's been missing out on her tea! Not to worry. Knowledge is vast. It's never too late to learn. As a beginner, you can try this method. First, observe the color. Then smell the fragrance, and finally, take a sip. Remember, you can understand anything as long as you approach it in the proper order. Chowing Village in Northwest Liyue is famous for their tea industry. It would be well worthwhile the visit when you get the chance. What I shared with you today are mostly my own habits as an old-fashioned Liyue local. Each region has its own tea traditions and culture. One should always respect the conventions of the local region. Paimon gets it. Uh, but whether Paimon can remember it all is another story. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for such excellent tea. It made my trip out here all the more worthwhile. If you ever come to manage a tea house, I will certainly be a regular. Well, we have a tea pot. Regardless, you have my complete support. Let's call it a day. I won't take more of your time. All the best with your new pursuit. Ah, yes. The bill. Just put it on Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor's tab. As usual. As what? Wait a minute. Yola, Bido, and Ningguan? Wait a minute. What is this aside? This view. A small foamy reef, please. <clears throat> Thank you. Easy drunk. I I'm fine. Huh? There's something off about Eula. <gasps> Was she already drinking before she got here? But foamy reef has coffee in it. Would it upset her stomach if she has coffee after liquor? Is that true? For her tummy's sake, let's water it down before serving it to her.
look like the... Really? Oh, this tastes pretty good. <sighs> water. That actually was my first try. Actually put all the water. One more, bartender. Uh, uh, oh, wait. It's you guys? You really recognize us now? Uh, sorry. I just came here from the cat's tail. Perhaps I had a little too much to drink. Wait, you got her drunk there? Wait, doesn't that girl actually doesn't have alcohol because of the honor? Really, game, you're breaking your own lord you set up so simple. Like. Okay, I really don't know the place. I know that the owner works there and the owner hates alcohol. But in a sense, I cannot expect her to not serve alcohol in her time. Actually, I don't know. This is like, again, the little thing that kind of make you confused. Like, wait a minute. What? Okay, I guess I have to stop rambling about because I already put too much time in the photograph shooting. Yeah, it's pretty lonely to drink by yourself. You'll feel better if you talk to us. Uh, I suppose I always do drink alone. As long as I'm in Mondstadt, I'll never be welcome at taverns. I was actually feeling good today and wanted a drink but they still wouldn't get off my back <sighs> tell me how did you manage to make so many friends easy i got you <gasps> oh that doesn't work all People the time always sound 
so appreciative and are always smiling when they talk about you. But as for me, just mentioning my family name is enough to make everyone... Hey, how about you don't actually give me that the name? I mean, okay, you keep the name for pride, but... Maybe try to actually win them over before you say, Hey, my name is... What's her family name again? I cannot remember. You didn't choose to be born into the Lawrence clan, and we don't care about that kind of thing. The Eula we know is a great person. But you don't like being straightforward. You always pretend to hold a grudge, and you try to hide your tenderness away from everyone. Hey, who said I was pretending? Do you think so? <laughs> it's impossible to imagine. <laughs> Even when I'm this drunk. Even after being a knight of Favonius for all this time, people still... <sighs> Whatever. Isn't this something Venti will say? Oh, right! Tone to fart said something wise like that too. When? Eula, and keep moving forward. Sooner or later, you'll change what people think about the Lawrence clan. Okay, thank you. I, <clears throat> I, sh I should go now. No need. I want to remember what you said. And I won't be able to think about anything else until I write everything down. Eula sure is a lot more open after a few drinks. But it does feel like something's missing without her signature revenge line. Uh-oh. When she wakes up in the morning, do you think she'll come threatening us to forget what happened today? I hope so. 